this video, we're going to do a beginning West Coast swing move, and it is a whip with an outside turn. I'd like to start off first with a regular whip. Okay, regular whip, eight counts, of course. I'm gonna lead the count with one, two. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. A couple things I wanna point out is that our arms stay the same here. He's not moving the arms all over the place. They're about waist height or the girl's arm parallel to the floor. She walks in. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now the whip footwork is the same in several of our whips. This particular one, which is a standard whip, is one, pick up two, I've got her in my arms, I go three and four, pivot and step on five, pivot and step on six, and send out seven and eight. And my footwork is just gonna look like this for a regular whip, one, two, three and four, five, six, seven and eight. But now we're gonna do a whip with an outside turn okay. and it looks like this. So, first thing first, I go to count four and deliver my lead on four. One, two, three, three and four. four. I want you to notice I'm gonna swing head and around. My hand is straight up, it's not tilted in, it's not necessarily way out here, just straight up, that's good enough. So we'll stop on count four with that. That tells the lady. Let's do it from this direction so I can see that. This is an outside whip, whip with an outside turn. One, two, three, and four. There's my lead, I know what it is. Okay, now no pushing or shoving on this hand. I leave my dance frame exactly like it is. I'm on my left foot, I pivot and step on the right foot. Not a large step, just a nice easy step. Then as I take the six, I roll her out, Leave the hand up in the air. She turns around seven and eight. Very important. I don't pull down on the arm. Okay, let's do okay, it. Okay, we'll do it from this direction. You get a different look. One, two, three, and, and four. four. It's the same. There's five, five roll out, six, six seven, seven, and eight. eight. Let's switch from here. Right here? Yeah. Same thing. Pick up on two. One, two, three, three and four. Here's five. There's six seven and eight. I'd like to show the whip for the, the footwork for the follower on this one. Okay, follower so follower. you're going to go one, two, three, and four. I got the lead here. I'm going to go five here. I want you to go all the way around to six right here. You're going to step on seven with the ball of your foot. You're going to go seven and you're going to twirl all the way around seven and you're going to go and eight. So I'll do it from this direction. So it's one, two, three, and four. I got the lead. Here's five. As he gives me six, I have to go on my left foot uh, all the way around. He's behind me now. That was six. I'm going to step forward on seven and twirl. Seven, a half a turn, seven, and eight. It's hard to do it slow. I'll do it from this direction. So one, two, three, and four. Here's five. I go all the way around on six. He has me here. I'm going to step forward and spin seven and eight. Okay? Okay. That should do it. All right. So let's just show it a couple more times. So here it is. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. And we usually finish with an underarm turn or some sort of move that we can straighten out. my hand right side up. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, thank you. See you later. Bye-bye.